go. I'm here with Olin Hacker, winner of the 5K. So, okay, tell me about the race. What did you go in there with your goals? Pretty good time. Better you. I think you would run earlier in the season, like a 13:30 and change, 30, yeah, 36, 36 maybe 36, in California yeah. earlier this season. So, what was your goal when you were coming in here today? You have to get the U.S. standard. I ran um, road 5K in Boston. I ran 13:27 there, and so like I was really happy with that. Thought I that I could go and run a good one, and then uh, yeah, I didn't run so well at sound running. So at this point, then it was just like make sure we get to USA's, and I uh, I just got that done. <laughs> Nice, and that like that standard was the goal coming into today's yes. race. Yeah, that was the goal. Nice. So how was how was it out there? Like, with, I mean, it was a good field, yeah. solid field, good to get the win. Yeah, no, it was awesome. The the Pacers did a great job. We were perfectly paced. The the lights helped a lot. And then, yeah, then it got hard uh, once they dropped, and I just tried to stay stay close to pace. And yeah, the the crowd brought me home, and I just yeah, I had to had to close it to get it. But I I knew where I was. So, can you tell us a little bit about your journey from? You know, last year, NCAAs, Wisconsin, you win. And then up until now, like, walk me through the journey towards maybe picking your club and, like, going pro and making all of those decisions. Yeah, last last spring was a little bit magic. I I just started running super well week in, week out. Um, and I feel like I just got better through the year, and I, I ended up winning NCAAs. And then, yeah, I kind of had – all of a sudden I had options on uh, pro groups. And so, yeah, I was kind of looking around. Um, and yeah, I ended up yeah taking a visit to NAZ, and I loved it there. Um, and then yeah, so I, I moved out to Flagstaff in September, and you know got used to the altitude, and I've been training out there. It's Flagstaff is beautiful, and it's been it's been great to work with the team. Um, and yeah, now now we're back at it. Now we're looking forward to USA's. How has the adjustment been to training at altitude? It's definitely been difficult. Like it's, I feel like uh, mostly it's like I feel like I have to learn a lot and learn you know, kind of what workouts at altitude are like and how to recover. Because yeah, it's just it's just different than sea level and I've never trained at extended period of time at altitude. So yeah, it's been a learning experience. So now you're looking forward, you got your US standard out of the way. What's coming up next and what are your goals for the rest of the season? Uh, yeah, it's uh, I think I'll run USA's next. So yeah, get a real good month of training and then yeah, see, see if I can see how well I can mix it up with uh, all the big boys. <laughs> Nice. And are you going back up to flag after this? Yep. yep. Perfect. Awesome. Well, good luck with your training. Thank you.